What's up everybody, it's your host Claire Dragoon, and in this uh, this video I want to talk about how to beat the general. Uh, I know you guys have heard of the general, it's been around a long time, uh, but how to beat the general in current meta. Uh, there's a lot of videos out there on old meta ways to beat this base design, uh, but I've got several examples of this war. Apparently this clan really likes this base design, but I'm going to start with my attack right here. And I got a Gova Hobo with an EQ, EQ entry. Uh, and we'll take a look at this attack and see how I handle this base. So obviously, um, I'm kind of taking a long route to the queen, but I'm opening up all this part of the base right here. I'm gonna get my funnel wizards out, wall break in. And there we go, entry point is made. Uh, here comes the bowlers and the heroes, and here comes that rage, and they're gonna just get up in here and tear up some stuff. So there it is, boom. CC is triggered. Uh, I'm gonna take care of that very shortly. But I go ahead and start my hog lines in and I get very generous with my hogs here. I really like going heavy handed on my surgical deploys. And at this point, I, I really shouldn't have healed right there. I probably could have got through, but I didn't need to hold it any longer. Honestly, the base was already wrecked. Probably right around here, I'm gonna heal this last spot. Yep, there we go, bomb tower. And there you go, the base is wrecked. But we got different we got different ways to handle this base and I'm gonna show you here in a second. After this cleanup here, we'll just fast forward through this cleanup. Got just a ton of hogs left, ton of hogs. Yeah, this, this base uh, definitely needs to go in retirement along with the Gala Trap. But anyway, here it is again. Um, it's, it's the same, basically the same base. Um, you know, it's a little different change up, but basically it has the same characteristics. So let's see how Yoshi handles his base. And as you can see here, there is no, uh, there's nothing here but the Pentaloon. I mean, he's going... He's going for broke here on this base. And he's not worried about his heroes there just for cleanup. So did you, did you catch that poison on the queen? So he dropped that, he's gonna bring that uh, next hound in over here on this air defense because that's the queen side. Right, here comes uh, another balloon here. And he's got a few more spells. He's trying to work through the sweepers. It gets a little hairy there, but it's all right. Here he goes, working through. And right there, he knew this base was a wrap. He hadn't even dropped his heroes. Yep, there you go. Heroes are down. They're just going to be here for cleanup. Where is this queen? Is this queen even in this fight? I don't even think he dropped her. Amazing. It's an amazing hit. But... You know, that just goes to show you the general uh, can be defeated uh, with an air attack quite easily. I mean, it is like complete, oh, <laughs> swag. Swag, haste, and uh, hero ability. Good job, Yoshi, very impressive. And Yoshi's got another hit, uh, and it's up here. Let me find it, there it is. And I think this is another general style, yep. So we'll take a look at how he handled this one. And as you can see here, he's got a queen walk prepared. Um, this one's gonna be a little bit more conventional, but he doesn't have much of a kill squad. He's got several wall breakers. So he's gonna use his queen to funnel here and get an air defense down with the queen walk portion. And maybe probably uh, try to get into that one. I'm not quite sure with his king. Did not see this attack live. I'm not quite sure. But he does have a level 30 queen, so it's not a big deal for Yoshi to get a lot of uh, value out of this walk. Oh, his queen can get both of these air defense right now. She, she's, she's got this. If she, if she goes in, and there's the CC pull. Gonna go ahead and rage her. Oh, wow, that Valkyrie put, he put a lick on her for sure. Yep, there it goes. It's all down. You could actually get the queen too. Amazing. 
boom queens down once he gets this next air defense it's it's a wrap so he's got a heal right here which i'm kind of curious about he's planning on healing some balloons here i guess so right there that air defense is down and now he can start his balloon portion of this raid And he's kind of holding off, waiting. And there goes the hound. Here comes his balloons. And, and like I say, he doesn't have very much left uh, as far as spells. So he's kind of, he's got to be sparing with these spells. Now he's going to heal through this. I like seeing this because this is interesting. These balloons are going to just kind of get get the healing. They're going to go slowly. And they're just working their way. He's got a hound left, a max hound, and it has got a lot of life on it. He really needs that hound to pop, honestly. And that expo is targeting his balloons and not the hound, unfortunately. But it's okay. Still got... If that hound pops, it'll be really awesome. Oh, Lord, he lost all his balloons right there. Holy smokies. He's okay. He's got plenty of cleanup from these uh, lava pups. And watch this. This hound is going to pop, and that's going to be all she wrote for this expo. Is there, these, these little lava pups are going to attack him right here. King's tanking, the bow don't know what to do, and that's a wrap. Excellent. All right, we got one more example uh, of this general base, and this hits by Ryan, and here we go. We'll take a look at how he handles it, and he looks like he's got a, a go hobo with EQ entry, my man. And let's see where he EQs in here to get the most value out of this thing, because this is kind of a tight base. But that's going to get him into the core right there and get him the queen and the CC. And here we go. Here's his funnel wizards. All right. Queen is going to come down at some point. There's the royals. Here comes the bowlers. And they got to cut off. Yep, there they go. They cut off those bowlers so they go into the core. He's got him under rage. That dragon's going to go down any minute now. Had to raise the king. Here comes his hogs. He kind of fanned them out so that they would set off those uh, bombs kind of one maybe at a time. Used to see that type of deployment in early meta. Or old meta, whatever you want to call it. Um, what did they call that? I'm trying to remember. Um, Asian Wall, I believe it was. Correct me if I'm wrong on that, guys, but... I think it was called an Asian wall. So right here, uh, Ryan is happy because uh, he basically only has a few more defenses to go through. His queen is, her ability is still there. Look at this. Boom, boom, boom. This king's going to go down. There he goes. And we will speed it up because this is just a cleanup job. He could go ahead and hit that queen. There he went. And it's a wrap, guys. And so if you see that base, and I'm sure you will, we run into that base a lot, and it's kind of like, ugh, not that base again. But anyway, you got to beat it. you got to take care of it. Never disrespect that base. It, it, it's, it's got a lot of point defense packed tightly, so you still have to be very focused on your attack. You can't just go to sleep and deploy with your eyes closed. But still, it's an easy base to defeat if you know how to do it. And I hope, this, I hope this helps you guys. Um, if you're going up against this base style a lot, I hope this video helps you. And I'm out of here, guys. Hope you enjoyed.